Ultimate STL Exporter, a new add-on for Blender. All right, let's get started. Edit, Preferences, and let's go find that package. Do, 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 loading Ultimate STL Zip. Let's turn it on. Documentation right here if you need it. And let's get to it. On the side panel, it's called USTL. There are three panels, Ultimate STL Export, Unit Converter, and Tools. We'll go over tools in a second. Now I'm going to import some models that I want to 3D print. Um, they're rather large, so I'm going to scale them down and rearrange them to see what I'm working with. Let's go to the Ultimate STL exporter. I have a nice button called Center Mesh. You'll see here the pivot is off. Let's hit that. As you can see, it centers the object and also places it on the floor. Very handy for placement later. All right, let's head over to the Tools panel. And you'll see I have some quality of life features. You can go ahead and set all of these. Just click them. You won't see much change on my screen since I already have them. Now let's create a build volume visualizer. So my printer is 400 millimeters, 400 millimeters, and 450 millimeters. And as you can see, there it is. That's an approximation of the build plate. And let's go ahead and start scaling everything down and placing it. Now that you have everything set up the way you like it, let's select everything. And over here, let's add it to the export objects. Anything that's in this list will be exported. You also have the option to export separate files, but for this demo, we're just gonna do it as one file. And let's pick the path and put the file name. Let's hit export. I'm using Cura, so let's open that file. And there it is. As you can see, it's exactly the same way that we laid it out in Blender. Looks good. Let's take a look. Yep, exactly the same. Now let's do some edits so that I can show you the real power of Ultimate STL Exporter. Now I'm gonna add those duplicated ones. You'll see that they go on the list and there they are. Let's actually grab everything, duplicate it, move it off to the side and show you that this add-on only exports what's in this list. If you're not sure what's added to the list, there's a nice little select button that'll allow you to select each item that's in there. And if you find something that's not there, you can always minus it out. Let's export and let's hit reload in Cura. Give it a moment. And there it is. Look at that. Let's ignore that error. There's a problem with the rock lobster. Now let me show you how easy it is to exclude something from it. Let's say you're working on something, but you're not quite ready to print it out, but you have it there. So let's go find that object. There it is. Let's minus it out. Export again. Let's go back to Cura and reload. And as you can see, it is gone. Thank you for taking a look at this overview of Ultimate STL Exporter. I hope you give it a try. Go to the Blender Marketplace or Gumroad. Thanks again.